I bought a Baxter filter adapter and it does fit uh, in your Land Cruiser 200 with bed belt armor if you have a differential drop. So that means no more of this nasty mess. And just gotta prep this. And oh my God, oil change. Oil changes, just a totally different experience. Baxter Performance. This video is for Land Cruiser 200 owners, model year 2008 through 2020. Uh, this is for the Baxter Performance cartridge spin-on adapters that really makes a difference in doing your 5,000 mile maintenance and or whenever you do your oil changes. Uh, I was really interested in this product, but although the vendor's website has the compatibility information, uh, what is not explicit or clear, and I even reached out to them, is whether their uh, cartridge spin on adapter works with a Land Cruiser front uh, armor plate. So it's absolutely compatible with the Land Cruiser, Tundra, Sequoia, but the issue is like, hey, could, could this fit within the plate? And I'm gonna, talk, I'm gonna talk more about that and cover that in this uh, review. So for those who may not know or know, your stock Toyota canister oil or filter housing is plastic. Uh, it's a two-step process to drain it. You gotta first drain the oil from the oil canister and then remove this. Uh, as you can see with this plastic, and it is a Land Cruiser, so you're like, seriously, why is this plastic? Anyways, this can crack or break, and this tool, I still haven't bothered to like remove it, to remove the canister. Sometimes it gets stuck, it's plastic. I mean, this is a conundrum for the Land Cruiser. This is, sucks, actually. So, one of my first of great options, oh, and just so you know, it's like, hey, you take that out, you clean it, and then this is, you put this oil filter in and put it back. It's a pretty simple process. It's just really messy. And this plastic sucks. So, you know, me wanting a better solution, because part of it, you know, I like off-roading or over-glamping, but I also like tinkering is, I, through the, you know, the beauty of YouTube, found out about, hey, I could upgrade to uh, metal housing versus this plastic. And then this, you know, minimize the risk of this cracking. And also, I believe the tools would work better with this. So it's like, yeah, this is this is where I was gonna go. And then I heard of the Baxter uh, catch cartridge spin on adapter. And after reading up that on that, it's just like, oh my God. I was like, this is the way to go. I wanted this solution to work. But for approximately $280, the question was, would it fit on my vehicle? So the actual Baxter uh, adapter, it adds an inch. So from where the, the fill, it, it connects to the engine, there's approximately an inch for the adapter. And the recommended or the required uh, oil filters added another five inch. So you have at least six inches I think it's safe to plan for a solid seven inches. And if you can measure that relative to where your front armor shield is, you're good to go. So I can't say with actual experience whether the Baxter uh, adapter works with a stock Land Cruiser. However, if you have a lifted Land Cruiser, uh, I have a two and a half inch lift and uh, bud built uh, armor all the way to the transition, excuse me, transfer case. But most importantly, I have a differential drop, a Dobinson differential drop. So with the Dobinson differential drop and the bud built uh, armor, I have no lack of room. It definitely fits. And I'm sure I have a picture I can share with you and show. And the, the end result is beyond awesome. Uh, it is super easy to do maintenance. Uh, well, 
I'll do another review on how easy it is to drain the oil pan with uh, the Bud Belt armor. <laughs> However, when it comes to the you know the, the next annoying part of uh, changing the oil filter, I mean it's just no comparison. It is so easy. These are hand tight, uh, hand remove them. It's super easy to pre-fill this with oil. You know, you just dab oil around and you just tighten it back up. I mean, it's 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 what I, I don't wanna say enjoy, it's my preferred way to deal with oil filters. Uh, what else? Anyway, super easy to install. Uh, I, I think at a minimum, if you plan seven square, seven inches square and checked, then this adapter will work on your Land Cruiser no problem. I actually, again, don't take my word for it, but with the stock front plate, uh, when I was looking, it looks like it is, but if I was you, I would just create a mock-up, you know, maybe get one of these uh, oil filter uh, boxes and just make a seven inch mock-up and then just see if it would fit with your armor plate there or whatnot. That's what I would recommend, but I'm not, I'm not vouching for that. I'm just, I have high confidence if you have a differential drop of any type. So that being said, there you go. And uh, if you have any other questions, uh, you can call the manufacturer. Or they were very responsive, they're pretty awesome. Uh, if you look deeper into it on the, on the manufacturer website, Baxter Performance, they do talk about there are advantages uh, especially for startup with their system. I can't speak to that. Uh, I'm, one, I'm not qualified. I have no direct experience with that, but I have been running this uh, system for about six weeks plus, and you know, oil pressure, all that stuff, everything looks normal. Cannot, uh, not having any issues. Uh, again, really excited for the simplicity uh, this brings to doing my 5,000 5, mile maintenance.